it's queen f8, and that's all she wrote. We've got, what, 3152 watching? We need to get to 3333 to be watching. Get the nice, nice, perfect number. Yeah. Okay, one more to go. Why am I lagging? I mean, come on, what's with the lag? The lag is ridiculous. Okay, but he blunders this one, and now I win. The queen and I block. The two queens win the day. There we go, next game. Windsor plus two, we're basically, this is like deja vu. This is deja vu, this is where we were like, um, Five hours ago, I was at like 3310. I was playing Liam Putnam to get to 3320. So this is like complete deja vu. Okay, I'm just gonna take and castle. I like my position. I'm eating apricots. What is that? Hmm. I don't understand Queen D4 at all. Queen Knight D7. So I'll go here, threat Knight B3. I also have E5 somewhere. Oh, I think his idea is to go for some big cheese with Queen H4 and some kind of weird checkmate idea. I don't know what he's doing exactly, but something like that. Um. Now I can just play Rook E8. I can also play H6. I think I'm just gonna go Rook E8 here. I guess we'll go here to guard the knight. Do apron coats keep you warm? I also have some uh, some prunes as well. Yeah. Go here. Yeah, they're dry. They're dried. Yeah, they're dried. Now I hit the pawn. I should win this. Should win the game. Yeah. Plenty of potassium and sugar, good for the brain. Yeah, I'm gonna go for the adoption here, I think. Um, so if I take the pawn, knight g5, I mean, it looks mildly dangerous, but I can also play h6 first. It's not an obvious decision here. I think I'm gonna go h6 instead, because I can always keep this grip sort of on the queen side. I can always keep the grip here. And so I don't need to give him any weird counterplay. How did our rating get so juiced? Um, I think it's just because I've been playing good chess, honestly. Just, I mean, it's just that simple rule. I've been playing pretty good chess over the last couple of days. Um, okay, knight f6 with knight e4 and knight g4 looks very good. As long as I'm not getting sauced on the king side. Which I don't think I, uh, which square do I go to? I've got two squares. I think this is the right one. Wait, isn't this just, wait a second, what, wait, wait a second, wait a second. I just take. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, let's go e4 here. If I beat him 10-0, I, I didn't adopt him earlier, I don't think. So if I beat him 10-0, that means that I get, a, get another adoption. Yeah. 3350, very, very unlikely. But I mean, we'll see. Maybe I can do something, maybe not. We'll see if I can do something special. Okay, I'm gonna play um, bear and take, I guess. With like c3 and knight f3. Play h4 maybe. The knight f3, maybe bishop g5 as well. Um, I think I will just castle here, why not? I'm gonna go g3, king g2, very simple chess, actually. I play this a lot with the black pieces. Um a lot. I play this a lot. Okay, I can go bishop g5. I can also play like queen b3. Forget how I'm supposed to play this. I've, I've actually lost in this exact position to Ali Reza a few times. I think I'll go here. And then go like queen d2 to guard everything. And now I've got a good bishop. b3 is uh, sketchy. I don't know if it's the right move, but it's playable at least. Um, although I don't like my position already here. Yeah, I don't like my position at all. What have I done? Okay, let's go here. really don't like my position. What have I done to this? Um, I guess I'll just go here to guard. I 
This is not a good position. This knight on f5 is so good for black. I don't, I don't know why I did this, actually. It goes rook c2, which I saw, but I thought I could play, like, bishop d2, maybe. Because now maybe I've got some knight g5, some kind of pressure against the flying v. I don't know. Maybe. Probably not, but maybe. Bishop h6 looks wrong. Actually... It looks very wrong to me for whatever reason, but I, I can't quite work out why, so. Let's go here. It looks really wrong somehow. Takes. He's got rookie two, maybe. He goes queen a6, but I assume that I can block again. And I blundered that. It's great. Just great, just great, Hikaru. Just really, really smart and stupid. Oh, why did I do this? Wait, King of One, Rook B2. I think I have to do this. Oh, he takes a pawn. I didn't think that was correct. Wait, I think I'm gonna actually beat him. I think he's gonna lose on the dark squares now. Yeah, I think he's actually just I'm gonna I'm gonna hit him with the lobster pincer. I think the lobster pincer is gonna be overwhelming here. But I have rook c7 and then there's some kind of lobster pincer incoming. I think I think this is very bad actually. Um I need to be a little bit precise here. I think rook c7 allows rook b1, which is why I'm gonna play this move first. Yeah, I, th I think there's a, there's gonna be an unfortunate lobster pincer incoming. Wow, he sacks. Okay. Um, go here. Go here. I mean, he still is going to have issues with lobster pincer. There's bishop f6. And now I go here, and he can't guard these knights. Yeah, he just loses to the right triangle as well. Okay, I'll take it. Not a good start, but I'll take it. Or, not a good second game, I should say. Let's take... Okay, we get the win. Let's keep going. Still plus two for wins. Lobsters and triangles. I mean, lobster sounds really good, doesn't it? Let's play b5, bishop b7. Go e6, c5 probably. Okay, goes a4 again. I'll play b4. Actually, I remember this is what I was playing against him before, and it wasn't working out very well. So I don't know why I decided to play it again. Um, got in a garbage position. Wait, actually, I could take ish i'm gonna go rook a7 and pretend that i'm okay which i'm probably not my rook does not belong on a7 here in any world so i don't know exactly what the fridge i'm doing i'm gonna play knight f6 here i guess i'll just go back and pretend that i'm okay this is pretty bad but i'll probably be okay okay so he castles so so I just take and play like bishop e7? I think that was a poor decision for my opponent, actually. Although I have to be careful because there are diagonals now to hit the rook. This is Ikaru's secret prep, exactly. Um, If I castle... If I go h6... Wait, 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 wait a second, wait a second. Okay, remember, I've got to remember, this is the dude who likes to go for the big fat cheese. Um, Is there a tactic h6? I don't see it. Like, 95, h6, takes, 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 I'm fine. 95, h6, 96, takes, I'm fine. Takes, takes. Takes, 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 takes. Oh, wow, he's got this one. Oh, that's beautiful. Shoot. I missed this. Great. Okay, now I'm down a pawn in an endgame. Lovely. Of course, he finds queen c6, and now I'm in real trouble. Go here. What am I doing? I guess I go here. Yeah, I'm actually throwing this game really, really hard. Like, harder than I, harder than I possibly could envision.
of course he finds queen e5 um I take and i take i mean i've got to be so careful not to get mated here on the h file but i think i'm okay i take i'm down a pawn but i'm down a pawn but i can also take this one and try to gobble gobble hobble hobble but if i take h5 queen d5 h5 f6 queen g6 i don't really like it so much so i think what i'm gonna play here is probably actually just like uh, how do i do this i don't want to go queen d5 i don't want to go rook d8 i don't want to i'll go here to play rook d5 maybe i gotta focus though i really do need to focus here so I'm down on clock and I'm down a pawn. So I'm gonna need I'm gonna need some some luck here too. I don't know what that is. He just gave me a free pawn. I mean he has an IG5, I guess, but Okay, I should be okay here if I'm if I'm practical about this. He's gonna go H6, okay. Can't afford to burn much more time though. Come on, you gotta move. I'll go here. Go here. Of course, he's got 95, which I also conveniently missed. But 97, maybe? I think I'm okay here. I hope I'm okay. I don't actually know if I'm okay, but I hope I'm okay. Problem is, I'm down on clock, too, which doesn't help. But I think I'm okay here, actually. I think I'm okay. It goes queen g3, so... I have to go queen f8. Takes. Rook b1, logical. I can also play g6, though, I think. Or wait. I think this works. This feels very puzzle rush-ish. I go here. There's no way for him to win material. I couldn't take because he has the right triangle. What is this? Wait a second. I should be winning here if I play this correctly. So, here I guess. Okay, I just got to go. Okay, now I should win. Yeah, now I just win. Good. <sighs> dangerous. Yeah, dangerous, but we got the win. Yeah, that was a very, very dangerous game. I could have very easily have lost it. Very easily could have lost. Let's play D4, C4. He had a win. I'm not surprised. He probably had multiple wins. But we got the win. That's all that matters. He, he was winning when you said, I think I'm okay. Aha, uh -huh, there's some kind of puzzle-ish. Okay. No more A6, but it's such a good move. I mean, I heard that the former world champion, uh, Magnus Carlsen, played it. So, I mean, if he can play it, then why can't I play it? Okay, it goes here. How do I want to play this, actually? I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm going to go 91 here. Let's take. I don't even know what I'm doing again, though. This looks very weird. Why is my knight on E1 and not F3? What am I doing? This makes zero sense at all. Do lobsters eat pineapple? That's a good question. I don't actually know. I don't know the answer to that question. Yeah, I actually don't know what that. I don't know the. I don't know the answer. Um, let's go here. What am I doing? I'm actually playing this very badly. I'm gonna go G3. If I'm able to get F4, and I should be okay here. Are there pineapples in the ocean? Good question. I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna go F4 here, which is obviously a absolutely horrible move. Absolutely a, an abysmally bad move. Jeez, what was that? Maybe I have this, though? 
It's so bad. What is wrong with me? Suddenly I can't play even halfway decent chess. I'm very lucky. I'm actually, I think, okay here. I don't deserve to be okay, but I am. He's going to use a lot of time looking for a knockout blow that doesn't exist. And of course I trade. Of course I trade. Okay, and now it's a matter of trying to just play good moves. Let's go knight c2. Yeah, now I've survived somehow. I, I, miraculously. Doesn't mean I'm going to win the game or anything, but I've survived. Or have I? <sighs> I saw, as soon as I played knight c2, I realized he had rookie two. Or do I have h3 maybe? Wait a second, wait a second. Think, think, think. No, no quick moves. I, as soon as I played knight c2, I saw it. As soon as, as soon as I played it, I saw the move. I saw it, so now I have to play rook d5 to cut him off. So otherwise he has a repetition. If I take, he goes check, 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 check with the repetition. So I've got to go rook d5, cut off the diagonal, but now everything's also hanging at the same time. I think I, I, think I tricked him. I think I swindled him here. I think I'm going to win. I think I tricked him. I think I actually tricked him here. I think I did. I think I tricked him. He disconnected. Wait, what? No, he didn't disconnect. Yeah, he's got this and it's still very much a game. Um, well, let's go here. I want to keep pieces on the board, basically. And this was ridiculous, too. Why did I do this? But I'm way up on clock, I think. Yeah. It's there. Now I start to use the uh, advantage on the... On the um, Go here, probably play h5, like maybe here h5. Go back and okay, now I'm, I'm well on my way to a dub. Resign, let's go again. Close game, close, close game. Yeah, no, no more a6. Let's play a proper French defense in honor of the classic French and their amazingly bad Imagine no line. Play knight d7, b6, bishop a6 here. Actually, yeah, let's go for this, let's trade. What's LMAO? What? I, 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 what's LMAO? I don't know. I don't understand. Let's play G6. Standard stuff. C5. Knight C7. French is as bad as A6. Okay. The Maginot was good. It just wasn't long enough. Yeah, it didn't. Uh, it did. <laughs> it did exactly what it was supposed to do. Okay. And that's why France fell to the. That's why you had the Vichy government, right? Play here and trade some queens. I can go queen d3. I can try to get all, all of in his business, but it doesn't look right. So I think I can also just, what do I want to do here actually is a good question. I, I don't actually know, so I'm just going to develop. I'll go here to hit the knight. I mean, it's very dank what I'm doing. It doesn't look right, but maybe it's okay. I'm probably going to go long as well. I'm probably going to cast my king to the queen side. That looks very strange. Okay, now I'm gonna go C4 and A5 for sure. French make great great wine and fries. Yeah, I mean, freedom fries here in America are amazing. Take the rook, I guess. I don't even know if that's right, but it's a move. I also have knight B5 here, maybe. Yeah, I feel like Mr. Um, my, my opponent's not doing so well. Give me one second, you guys. Okay, so he plays bishop b2. Um, I think I have bishop a3 here. Let's just take. Don't I have knight c3 or am I crazy? Liam versus Cherry. Yeah, I was just getting my food, you guys. You can see it. Yeah.
I think I just take the bishop. Yummy? Yeah. Is it bussin? Of course it's bussin. Okay, I think I just go here and I just start pushing P. There we go. Next game, five up, five down. Okay, now I feel like I'm back, kind of. I feel like I'm finally grooving again. Yeah, the good mood is slowly coming back. Slowly, slowly, slowly. Yeah, the good mood's back until a sudden loss. It just, like, ruins everything, right? Yeah. Wow, you streamed for a long time. Yeah, my, my re I set a new record, you guys. I set, a, I set a record earlier of 33, 34, an all-time record. Um, so I did set a new record, so I'm, I'm kind of grooving a little bit. I don't know if I like E5. Wait, okay, I think I just... Castle, why not? Or did I just blunder D4? No, I didn't. I just take. Go back. I think I'm doing very well this game. Previous record was 33-32 set by me. That was the previous record. I, it's like rice with some ground beef and some green beans. And corn. And pickles. Hmm. I feel like there's something good here, but I don't see it. Let's go here to hit the bishop. Was that before or after the queen d8 blunder? It was before. Pickles seems odd. Yeah, I don't know. Pickles, green beans, corn. Mm hmm. Hmm. I should be better here, but I think what I just did was stupid. Mucho stupido, actually. Rook c1. This is also even more stupider. I think. Or is it? No, no, it's not because I've got 95. No, it's not. What's the difference between a cheesy opening and a corny opening? I don't know. I think I'm actually doing very well in this game. It goes there. I mean, maybe I'm not. Uh, or wait, no, I am. So I have queen e5 to force the queens off the board, and then he's got all kinds of problems on the queen side. Hmm. Hmm. Wait a second, I've got 95. Wait, do I have rook d1 with the classic ice skater? I do. We have the classic ice skater and he loses the game. Yeah, here comes the ice skater to town. We are young tonight. I have h4, which I think is fine, but knight c6 looks like the right move. Bishop h3, I just go g3. And now there's like bishop c4. I mean, this should just be completely winning for me, unless I'm missing something very obvious. This bishop f8, logical move. Okay, what's the reasonable continuation? Knight e5 looks very solid. Um, Just to hit the knight. Bishop c4 incoming as well. It should be very, very good for me. In fact, I think this is probably just winning. I don't think this is just good. I think this is just winning. I go here to hit the pawn. He has to go back. I trade, and now it's just like... Just an absolute dream with the kebab and a bastion. Another free juicer to take. Resigns. Let's keep going. Let's keep playing the French, because somebody said the French is such a bad opening, so let's keep going for it. Um, no, 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 no. Oh, uh, that's a blunder, actually. He just made a mistake. Yeah, this is a mistake. He just blundered. Uh, he goes to f5. I actually lost a game, I think, in this exact system against somebody. Maybe it was against Morozevich. I lost this exact position, I think. Morozevich and, like, Reggio Emilia many years ago. Yeah.
Yeah, this is terrible for um, terrible for white. I take and I go queen c5. So here and now I just I just have an extra pawn in the center of the board and it's an end game and I just win the game. What happened to Morozevich? I think he um I think he just stopped playing chess. I don't know why, but he just did. Let's go here, of course. Okay, I think I just go like king e7. Maybe let's play Le Bon Cloud. Go here and rook f8, and I should be fine. As long as there's no sack, which I don't see here, I'm just winning. How good was Morozevich? I would say he at his prime in his prime, he was 2800 plus in his prime. Like very, very good player. I would say close to 2,800 strength. Very, very, very innovative and creative player. Okay, now he goes there, but that doesn't actually do anything. So I guess I'll go here. This is step one. If I take, 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 I hang the pawn. So he's not, he's not going to trade the rooks right away. But I think I'm going to cut him off with bishop c6 and just hold all the glue with the wooden shield in a second. Go. Wait, what? I don't understand. Am I missing something? I'm not. I'm not. He's just on. Oh, wait. Did he come up with some? Oh, wow. He found a tactic. Oh, wow. I call me impressed. He found a nice tactic. Unfortunately, um, it's not going to be enough to uh, to survive. Very nice tactic, though. I give him a lot of credit. He's just going to lose the pawn and with it, he's going to lose the game. Here. I also have knight c5. Let's go knight f4. Go here. And now it's just force checkmate with the rook and the knight in the corner because the king has no square. What's in your head? In your head. Who is Arkady Kromeyev on the Bolt leaderboard? I don't know if it's like ne it's Nepo or somebody. I don't know who it is. I'm not sure, but it's somebody like Nepo. Hmm. He goes knight f6, which I don't like. Let's play knight d4 to hit the bishop. Why am I not playing Montenegro for America? Because it's the European Team Championship. It's all about the European Union. Um, it's not about America. Because we're too good for the European Union. Reddit says the 2000 kid rated below 2100. No, he's a FM, so he's probably 2300. No, he's 2300, right? It says FM. He's a FIDE master, so he can't be below 2100. Wait a second. This looks really bad. This looks really bad. What is he doing? Wait. Wait a second. I know that this is winning. I just need to be careful. I mean, am I not just up extra materials here? I just check him and then move the queen. Yeah, this looks very bad for black. He's playing like a 1400. Okay, you guys. If you want to step into the Thunderdome and play against me, I, I I I have my doubts that you'll do any better than he's doing. Okay, do I take or do I just check? I mean, almost all roads lead, kind of lead to Rome. I think I'm just gonna go check, and then go like takes in here. I mean, I'm just up a pawn for nothing basically. Ah, he ah he came up with an idea actually. I missed this G6 move. I'm up a pawn, but it's not trivial to prove. It's actually not trivial at all. But I think I'm gonna go here, and then rook a c1 probably. Now let's go here. It's not super trivial. I'm still much better, but... Um, go check.
Okay, I do have ideas here. Like, queen d4 is a move. I mean, I don't know what I'm actually playing for. That's the problem with this position. Um, let's make a check. Surprisingly tricky. Um, what am I doing? No, I can't do that. I guess I'll go here. I don't know what I'm doing, actually. I, I'm, I'm actually kind of messing this up a little bit. I've let him get a lot more play than he should have in this position. I'll still probably win the game, but I've, I've kind of messed this up a little bit. Hmm. Yeah, this is not trivial anymore. Um, I guess I'll go 95 and take. This isn't really what I want to do, but I think I have to do it. Here. Check and now I should be safe because now at some point I'll be able to unwind the pawns. How often do I shave? Um, that's a weird question to ask, but um, go here. What is this yellow thing? What yellow thing? Sorry. Oh, let's just take. We'll go here, guard the pawn. More than happy to trade because now I fixed the uh, I fixed the um, queen side pawns here. Go F3. Actually, he trapped his rook, kind of. Let's go here, I guess. Now I activate the rook, and now let's bring the king in. G4, fix the structure. Okay, let's keep going. Still plus two for a win. Okay, let's play C5, one of the older systems. I'll just take... Okay, let's play d5, of course. Like, Wow, he takes with the bishop, which... Oh, why did I do that? Why did I do this? This is ridiculous. Ah, <sighs> so stupid. Plays d5, of course, not to take. Let's take. This is gonna get very wild very quickly, but I, I've got a I've got a g file. I've got a g file and a diagonal for the win. Knight f4. Knight h3, knight g5. I mean, I don't know if this is actually working, but it looks very scary for white. Oh, whoa, do I have queen h4 after g3, maybe? I think I do. Oh, wait, I think I do, actually. It's too beautiful to not play. I'm doing a Botez Gambit, because I have a checkmate. And I'm also going to mate him with the uh, Lobster Pincer, or whatever you call it. I think this works. No, I guess I have to check. Go here. I'm playing for all the diagonals. I also stop bishop b5. I also have knight e5 here. I assume this is winning. Go here. Of course, overload the pony. Do I have rook d8 here to even further overload him? Oh, wait, I've got knight f4. Oh, yeah, baby. Look at these knights. There we go. This takes, and he just he gets killed on the diagonal. There was a similar game against Daniel, that's right, quite a while back. That's true. 
I sound like Yas or Sarawan. Okay. Wait. Oh no, why did I? Wait, why did I play this? This is stupid, this doesn't work. I was trying to get too cheesy. I'm still fine, of course. I just drop back, play like D4, B3. It's not what I wanted. I, was I, I thought I was just winning. I thought I, was, I went for something that wasn't winning. Let's play D3. I don't think I get two though. I think this is the last game where I get plus two. If, if I got plus two for more games, I would definitely play play more. But I think it's plus one in a second. Okay, plays knight h5. I'm gonna just go g3, cut off knight f4, king h8. Now I think I have d4, and knight d4, and knight f5, and look at everything activation. Look at the activation. Take, go for the knife on f5. This is really bad for Mr. Liam. Really bad. Why are Georgia, Azerbaijan, Armenia, and Israel playing in the European tournament? Um, I don't know. Um, uh, that might be a very good... Uh, Queen f6 is actually a shockingly good move. Ah, crud. Do I have, wait, no, I've got knight f3 and e5 maybe, though. Let's go here. I have e5 still. Ninety-five rookie five. Hmm. Guess I'll go here. I have a feeling there's probably something with e five, but I don't see it right off. I have a feeling there probably was something with e five, but I, I don't see it, so I might as well just keep it stable. And now, if I get the knife to f five and I open up the scope, I should just be winning. Like this looks horrible. I've also got knight h four, and my knights are jumpy, jumpy. Which one? Knight h4? Knight, I think I'm just going to go knight f5. I've got the knife on f5. What does that do? Nothing. I can try to harass him with knight to e5 now. Look at these knights. There's also knight h4. Knight e5 looks right, though. Let's go for it. Look at these knights. These knights. Oh... Hmm. Fabiano is on Fox 2 now with Polgar. Yeah, that's like the uh, St. Louis uh, news show or whatever. They have like some kind of weird gig or deal or something. I'm, I'm aware of it. Let's play F3, create the classic uh, snake formation. It really does make me sad that there's so many people who don't know what snake was. Not going to lie. Let's go here to trade off the rooks. Bring Tifu back. Uh, I don't know what you mean, bring Tifu back. What you mean by that, exactly? I mean, like, Tifu's the man, but I, I, you want, what are you asking, exactly? Wait, I'm, I'm thinking too long. Um, go here. I got, I got to focus, sorry. I had Rook D6, F6, maybe, but I think Knight 3 saves again. I've got the classic Ice Skater. Let's just drop back. Maybe their Rook D6 was good, but who cares? Wrong stream? No, I mean, Tifu's, uh, a knight of five again. Maybe I do. I don't care. I'll just go here. Okay, now I'm going to hit him again with knight of five. And I might create the bathtub formation with these pawns soon. Now let's go here. T Queen h4 was wrong in my game. Oh, shoot. Did I just blunder? Oh, God. No, I didn't blunder. Okay, good. Or, wait, what did I just do? Did I just blunder? Oh, shoot. Talking too much. Stupid. Here, I can take and take, I guess. Very stupid. I'm still going to win the game, but very stupid. Yeah, no, Tifu, um, I, I had a short short interaction with him on Twitter. He was asking about Pog Champs in, in a long time ago. And obviously, he's like the first big streamer that I really watched on, on Twitch. So, I mean, it's not completely out there to bring his name up. Go here. I'll go here. 
Oh, shoot. Is that a blunder? That was. Oh, yeah, yeah. What am I doing? Come on, don't flub this. I flood this. Oh, he blunders. Oh my God. Holy mackerel. Oh my gosh. He nearly flubbed it. Winds are plus one. No, nah, winds are plus one. That's good. What was that? What was that? That was ridiculous. Mm mm. Mm mm. No, if he gets his rating back up like 10 points, I'll play him again. If he gets a rating back up like 10 points, I'll, I'll play him again. Poggers 33-31, yeah. We have a new son, yeah. That's like uh we, we've adopted a lot of people. N now I'll play some I'll challenge Buddy again. Now that my rating's high, is he gonna accept? Let's see. Let's see, is Buddy gonna play now? Probably not, actually. Um Yeah, I very, very nearly threw it. Yeah. Break the record again. That's my goal if I can find somebody with plus two. But you know what? Maybe I just play Liam at plus one, honestly. No, I think I'm just going to play him at plus one. Why not? I'll play him at plus one. Yeah, why not? Let's go here. I already set a record today, so I don't really care. If I hadn't set a record today, I probably would agree with you. Like, I, I probably would be very careful, but I already set a record, so who cares? Like, I feel like we played this position earlier too. Block, trade, trade. Yeah, 33-35 would be a good new record. But the problem is, you guys, I really need to press it hard now. Because if I, if I don't press it hard now, there's basically zero chance of me getting to a new new record. Because tomorrow I'm playing Title Tuesday. I actually don't know why I did this, by the way. Go here. Yeah, because I'm, I'm going I'm to be playing Title Tuesday tomorrow. So I'm going to lose rating points no matter what. So I've got to try and get something higher. Tomorrow I'm gonna go a perfect score, 11 out of 11. Yeah, that that would be nice, but let's let's live in reality, you guys. It's not gonna happen. <laughs> okay, I guess I'll go. I don't know which rook to put on D, but I'm assuming that the rook doesn't belong on C8. Let's go like here, maybe. Oh, this doesn't do any. What the? I thought I had some weird tap. Or wait, I do it. Wait, I do have knight f4 here, maybe, but I don't like it, so I'm just gonna go here. back I mean my queen is kind of busy here near his king I've also got right triangles which abound so I'm, I'm close I've done 11 out of 11 a couple of times but I mean it's like two or three times max yeah we're gonna try to get the record again though La 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 Okay, that looks like a bad move, but I don't see the killer blow. Feels like there should be something like 94. I don't see it, so I think I'm just or Rook D4 would hang knife here. What the heck? I think maybe I just play solid chest here. Like there's no way to play solid chest, so I guess I'll just go here to hit the knight. 
Go here to hit the bishop. That looks wrong too. Okay, here comes the classic kebab on the seventh in honor of XQC. Uh, there's bishop b6. There's also just rook eight. Wait, is it? Wait, ah, where's my rook? There it is. Bishop b6. He has c5. I take. If I take the pawn, he has some g3. Cheesy, cheesy. Um. Okay, wait a second. If I take and play rook a2, what's going on? And he's got. Let's take and take. Hopefully, I'm not blundering something here. Let's have g3 or something. I have to be very careful here. City. I guess I'll just trade and play like a6. Okay, let's go here to hit the bishop. I still have to be very careful here. That's the main thing. I just have to be really, really precise. Um, let's go here to trade the queens. I guess I can play here to hit the pawn. I feel like this position is starting to collapse a little bit for my young opponent. It's starting to collapse quite a bit. Do I not have an ice skater here with like e5? Don't I have an ice skater? He has bishop b6, queen d3, and then he's getting hit anyway. Um, wait. If I, wait, if I take, knight b1 probably should win, knight b1, yeah, there's, there's still the ice skater, so I create the fossil and an ice skater threat at the same time, and now I just take, and now, I mean, this should be very basic, go here, go here, try to trade the queens, um, I'm sure queen a8 wins, but there's no need to go for anything cheesy, so let's go back. Why did I do that? Let's just go here. No no need to be stupid here. Just blockade and win the game like a, a normal sane person. Around the world. go let's keep going three more to go that was so clean it was a pretty good game i wouldn't say it was completely clean but it worked out pretty well um okay wait i can go 92 maybe knight of 4 knight g3 let's take go here pressure the knight Come on, Hikaru. I'm doing the best that I can. It might not be good enough, but I'm trying. Ah, Bishop F6. Free, free, free pawn. Go here, hit the pawn anyway, and look at D's knights. Look at D's bishops as well. Perfect harmony in my position. Highest rating is 3334, I believe. Okay, I'm just going to drop the bishop back to H3. Ah, uh, that was a mistake, of course. I'm going to go G3, and probably I'm going to Fianchito my bishop now. Manually Fianchito it. Did I blunder C4 or something? I might have. Let's go here. Probably work D1. I also have Knight D2 somewhere as well. Okay, logical. Let's go Knight D2 here. Do I have C5 here as a question? Oh, no, I don't. Oh, great. I don't. 
Uh oh, did I just blunder something here? I might have. Mm, this is not what I wanted, that's for sure. Gotta be careful here. Hmm. Have to trade. I should be okay here. Still very tricky though. It's a very, very dicey situation here. I think he's trying to make some tactic like Bishop F4 work, but it just doesn't work. Let's go here. I think this works. Threatening mate. Magus tweet blue what up? Did Magus tweet something? Did I miss something? I don't know. So go here. I, I gotta pick up the speed. I'm, I'm up on time, but no, he didn't. Okay, so whatever. I think I can go here to pressure the pawn. Why did I do this? So stupid by me. Rook C1 was a horrible move by me. I'm still okay because I have King H2, but... Wait, that seems like a... Um... Wait, do I have Rook C... Wait a second, Rook C4? Yeah, I think that's just wins. Yeah, it's just wins. He's pinned on the file. I mean, the game goes on for a while, but I should win this game now. Let's put the pawn in A3, of course. Start pushing the P with a five. Gotta gotta keep up the pace. Let's go F6 here. Trying to go for a lolly with Queen G5. Ah, great, I just blundered. Oh, I blundered again, he missed it. Very bad. Start, keep I keep pushing the P. It's actually not easy to win. Um, okay, but he blunders this one, and now I win. A queen and I block. The two queens win the day. There we go. Next game. He car every second. Oh, I blundered. I do blunder a lot. Not gonna lie. Okay, right. And he's gonna play this line. I need to remember not to blunder. It's one where he goes knight a3 and he goes bishop e2 and I need to remember to play a6 or c6. Both are playable. I think I'm going to play, uh, I'll play the a6 line here. I'm 33, 33. Yeah, it's been a long time. I When I missed it the first time all those years ago in 2020, which really does feel like a lifetime ago, I was doubtful that I would ever get back there. I was so upset at myself because I was, it was plus one and I was 33, 32 and I lost and it was just so sad. I was so sad when that happened. Oh, let's go b5. Actually, I also don't know why I did this. This is also completely wrong. I misplayed this. Okay, let's just castle, I guess. Who's was A4, which I don't really like. Um, do I play B4 or not? I think I'm just gonna go C6 here. And maybe like go rookie eight. Takes, I'll take. I mean, I guess I'll take. Why not? Takes, let's go here. Pressure the bishop. I mean, I'm starting to get a little bit happy on the king side, just a little bit. Go here, guard everything. Ang angling for queen h3 somewhere. I've got a very nice position again. 
Yeah, three years later, yes. I, I mean, I remember it very vividly. Like, it's, I do actually. Go here. Go here and knight g4, big, big threats. Also, bishop g4 and bishop f3, wait. But this looks correct to trade the bishops. Don't I have knight g4 here? Mm, he found a way to defend this, unfortunate. But I still have rookie six. Go here, knight d5. I still have a very nice position. It's maybe not easily winning because my bishop on c7 isn't great. But long term, I should be in really, really good shape to win this game. Like h6. Oh, did I blunder rook c5? It kind of did, but whatever. Go here to hit the bishop. I want to keep more pieces on the board, basically. I do have knight d5 now, though. Or wait, no, I've got queen e2, maybe? Wait, queen e2? Hit both. Tricky, tricky. Maybe here to hit the rook, hit the bishop. Actually, I'm just winning. Rook c2, I take, yeah. There we go, another win. Or not. Wait, he's got rook a5. Don't, don't count your chickens before they've hatched. No, I missed rook a5, of course. I thought I was just winning the game. Like a total dumb something. Um, uh, it's still tricky. It's not easy to win this. I'll go queen a6. But he's really hanging by a thread here. I mean, this is very hard to play. Wait, bishop b4? No, I guess not. Play. I'm just going to go h5, h4. I'm going to get... Oh, he's got this. Okay, I'll go back. Queen f1 was a good move that I missed. Um, let's go back. Definitely going to go h4, like right here. Because rook e8, I always have queen b7. I can also just take. I also have knight d7. Let's go back. And now I've got knight d5 lurking. I also have knight g4 lurking. Wait. There we go. Classic fossil. Let's take the rook. There we go. Okay, now it's just a matter of killing him on the B file, basically. Go here. I'm sorry, not killing, but winning the game. Um, go check. Hmm. I don't actually have a forced win, do I? Strange. Weird champ. Maybe, or maybe I have queen B2 to hit the knight. Actually, this is how I win. Yep. This is not history, you guys. My my record earlier was the same record. Let's go here and now. Can't guard everything. Yeah, another win. Let's keep going. Here we go. This is our chance at history. This is plus one, by the way. Or no, every game's plus one. What am I saying? Gotta go for it with E4. Vincent Kamer lost? Wait, what? Wait, Vinny lost? Wow. Wow, Vinny. Not so not so bueno, my man. Not so bueno. Oh, he blundered in an endgame again? Hmm, unfortunate for Vinny. I jinxed my cousin Vinny? Yeah, exactly. Let's go to HG3. Queen E2. We need one more, yeah, one more game to get to 30. Hmm. No, I didn't bet on Vinny. I'm just shocked that he lost. But he is playing Predka, who's been on a big heater lately, including in the Isle of Man. Okay, let's see. I guess I'll just go here. I don't know. I Bishop C1 is probably just better. But there is Rook C1. There's H5. There, there are a lot of problems in this position for Black. Um, let's take with a bishop. He'll go 95, I thought. I guess not. I mean, this looks horrible for black because he's, he's he's gonna. Okay, also a move I didn't expect. Let's take with a pawn. I mean, I guess he can castle queenside, but then I take and I get knight f5 anyway. I mean, it looks very, very bad. Okay, I guess I, um, I can take and go knight f5. I think castles is actually a better move here. Prophylactic to stop him from being able to castle queenside. What? Huh? 
go here, hit all the pawns, classic right triangle. There we go, another win. Do we keep going? I think we go for one more, right? Let's try to win five more, five more for it. Five more, let's let's go for five more, okay? Let's see if I can get to 19, 20, no, 20, zero. Let's see if I can get to 20, zero, right? That seems like a good, good, good idea. Uh, let's go here and here. Yeah, 20, 20, zero seems like the score, yeah? I agree. Let's play H5, H4, classic, uh, classic Robert James Fisher. Um, Robert James Fisher played this a lot. The uh, classic um, King's Indian attack. This was a big favorite of Robert James, also known as Bobby Fisher, the former world chess champion. My, this is my peak rating. This is my peak rating. But I think, I mean, if I, I'm going to go for the double adoption. Um, I'm going to go for the double adoption, try to get to, get to, um, Get to 3340, and then that's good enough for me. <clears throat> hmm. Now I have 94 <coughs> and knight g3, which looks very good. What is the best rating? I I mean I've been higher, but or not higher than this, sorry, but. Um, excuse moi. Excuse moi. Excuse moi. Let's just trade. I have knight g3. Excuse moi. Quoi? Okay, new record. Let's keep going. Okay, next game. Let's keep going. <clears throat> he might be done. I wouldn't be shocked if he's done here. No, he's not done. He's he's a glutton for punishment. He's a glutton for the punishment. Play C4. Let's keep going, you guys. We're we're pushing it. We're pushing it. We're pushing it like um we're pushing it like it's something. I don't even know if that doesn't make any sense at all, but yeah. Okay, he takes with knight again. This guy seems to be a little bit too uh happy to take with the, the knight. Let's go d4. I had this, I think, in maybe one of the first games against him earlier. Hmm. Queen d5 is a very weird move. I'm gonna go f3. What is this bro doing? Oh, somehow he's not losing here, even though he should be. I'd see four, queen, seven. Very lucky that he's not just lost here. Very, very lucky. He blundered, but he got away with it. Ah. I guess I'll just play a classic uh, middle game. I guess I'll take with the queen. I mean, this guy is a very good, um, a very good tactical player. I do have 94 here. This is a little bit dangerous because this is trending towards, um, this is trending towards, towards like a rook and pawn end game, but I think I am just much better here. This, of course, I, oh, wait, I've got knight g5, uh, knight g5, rook f8. I guess I just trade. Wow, it takes with a pawn, which looks hideous. That looks absolutely hideous. Why on earth would you ever take with a pawn? Yeah, I'm start. I'm 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 starting to get more play again. This is starting to look very very bad for my opponent. Got an 85, which is actually potentially a good move. Although I have rook a4. I blunder that shoot. Oh no, I blundered. Okay, let's go back. Actually, it's not it's not a clean blunder though, because I can still take. It's a mistake, but it but it's not the end of the world because rook eight I have night before you because there. Of course I go back, cut off the kebab. Also guard the pawn. 
Those work deforge I don't particularly approve of. Um Okay, so how do I play this? Rook C1 makes a lot of sense. G4 also makes a lot of sense. I think I'm gonna go, hmm, I don't wanna play G4, so I think I'm gonna go here first. And then I'm gonna go G4 next move, basically. Okay, it goes there, which I don't like either. E5, logical move. Mm, I think I'm just going to start pushing P up the queen side here. I could have played A3, which I think was actually a lot better, but who cares? Yeah, I'm just pushing the P. Got to be very careful how he does this, man. I think I might have some way to win already, almost. Maybe not win, but... I mean, like, A7 looks very dangerous already. Although I did misplay this naturally. Go here to trade some rooks. It's a tricky position still for my opponent. Goes there. Plays c5, which looks kind of insane to me. Where do I put my king is the question. I guess I'll go here. And I blundered. Oh my god, how did I blunder that? Wait. Ridiculous by me. Wait, oh, how am I so low on time? What the heck? Wait, how am I so low on time? What the fridge? What the heck? I have to make the draw. Draw! Oh, man. Draw. Hmm. Good try by Liam. <laughs>